Hi, this is Charting Man Dan of TheChartGuys.com, home of technical analysis education. Click the link for a free week trial, no credit card required, and gain access to our multiple live broadcasts daily, community chat room, educational videos, nightly watch lists, and more. Invest in your education and future and join the community today. Hey everyone, looking at SPY on the daily, weekly, hourly time frame. So the bulls showed back up again today and notice the pattern, the big Deutsche Bank dump day, we had a higher open and a strong bull day. Big dump day again, the lows bouncing off the same area, higher open and a bullish day. So the bulls are defending 214 psychological support and we're rejecting from the 50 day moving average resistance three days in a row. That's right at 216, 215.97 to be exact. So the bulls need to get over that level to be looking back up at 217.12 resistance. But if they cannot do that, we're looking back down here at 214. So essentially the past couple of days, we've been in a range between 214 and 216. And we'll see once we get a clear break. We have the MACD, a little choppy, but still maintaining bullish. The RSI tighter and tighter and tighter. Seeing that range get real tight as well. The weekly time frame. Still watching, let's zoom in here a little bit, but I'm still watching SPX rather than SPY. And that's because I like how the price is reacting to that 10 week moving average resistance, 2165.95. And the bulls have to close above that by the end of Friday to break out. Otherwise we're in a continuingly constricting channel between the middle Bollinger Band of 2140 and that 10 week moving average resistance. And we would likely see a clear break next week if the bulls cannot get over that level this week. So the hourly chart, I'm watching the 200 period and I've been pointing that out in these videos. We bounced off this a few times, acting as support, it became resistance. And I was surprised that the bulls were able to get right through that here pre-market, turn it into support, back test it, hold it as support into the open. And then the low of the open held it, the pullback and low of the day bounced off of it again. And that's really showing the bullish strength. So a lot of action the past five days around this 200 period hourly moving average and it's been a nice guide and we know that the bulls are strong when it's support and they are weak when it is resistance so that's at 215.48 and we did close above it and we'll see how the price reacts to it tomorrow we have some clear lower highs and that clear 214 base so things are getting tighter and tighter and i don't really like the drawing capabilities on fidelity but let's just throw this downtrend line here and we actually did break above that earlier today so that's not a fitting downtrend line just playing that out seeing it live in front of everybody but looking at that level very closely tomorrow to know whether to be looking at a bullish or bearish day we also had an inside candlestick on the daily time frame and the inside candlestick is when the range of the day or whatever time frame you're looking at fits completely within the previous candlestick and what you get once you break the range so tomorrow we'll look at the range of today 214.78 low and 216.13 high and which whichever one of those breaks indicates the odds are more likely that the day will be in that direction and you can look back at the history we had some inside days here as soon as the high of this candlestick broke we had a bullish indication and we did close strong here's another inside candlestick where the range tightens same thing we break the high bullish indication so keep an eye out for these inside candlesticks. Watch how they play out. I like them on the hourly and the daily time frame as well. I think in the spy video yesterday, I highlighted how I did a bearish play on a break of an inside hourly candlestick. So it's a nice technical tool to have in your tool belt and worth keeping an eye on. Thanks for watching. We'll check back in tomorrow. Have a fantastic night.